Hi guys, what's up? So uh, what we're gonna do today is uh, mount the quad lock uh, phone mount on a, on a Truxton uh, TFC. So uh, what I wanna show you is actually a device uh, that I found on, a, on an amazing website. It's a, it's a bike shop uh, called the uh, Thornton 100 and it's gonna make things a lot easier. And the aspect that the quad lock is gonna have like the, the, the design it's gonna give to the bike is gonna be a lot, much better because it's not going to be as you know as as thick as uh, as busy on the bike. It's uh, you're going to see. I'm sure all uh, all the people who have Thruxton are going to be uh, tempted to go check their website. Uh, the other good aspect is that you don't have to drill anything to mount the quad lock on your bike, and uh, and and that's amazing because you know you you don't want to damage your your brand new bike or your bike. So uh, so let's check this out. So those are the different parts that you need to, to install it. So you have the, the fork stem mount, the motorcycle one from Quadlock. Uh, I decided to go with the vibration dampener because uh, apparently, you know, once it's installed, the phone might uh, go all over the place and I don't want it to be, to be damaged as well or to fall off the, the mount and then hit the bike or, you know, so I decided to go with that. You have the case coming with it. So in my case, I have an iPhone Pro Max. And then uh, you see this blue part, like the locking lever. Blue is not going well with the with the color of my bike, so I decided to go with the with the black one. And here is the part that has been made uh, custom made by uh, Thornton 100. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the, the the link of their website below, so you you can check it. I think the price was around 89 pound so i'm not sure how much it's gonna make in uh, in us dollar i think it should be around 100 110 uh, but that's uh, that's all the parts you need so um just before starting just to show you what's coming in the box so you have the locker and the different elements to uh, to mount to the bike in our case i think we're just gonna need this part because this is not required thanks to the to this part here uh the damper as you can see everything comes with the with a key so it makes it easier you don't need to have anything uh, the the case the phone case it looks uh, pretty sturdy pretty pretty solid so it's uh, it's good quality and then the the last uh, the last uh, locking uh, locking piece that we saw before so first thing to do is uh, I applied some uh, some tape on it so I don't damage the the the, the nut because uh, I don't want to you know if I want to replace it, I mean, to put it back on the bike, I don't want it to be damaged. Okay, so now it's very loose. Okay, it's unmounted. So what we have to do is place this piece. As you can see, there's still a bit of grease, which is perfect. So you place it, it's perfect, my God. Those guys are amazing, you know. So now I've just placed over the stem nut the dampener. So I'm just gonna tighten it and then we'll see the next step. When you're installing the dampener, make sure that you place it properly on the on the bike, I mean straight, because the minute you tighten it, it's, uh, it's a bit deviated. So you're gonna have to unmount it to put it back. So try to do it the first, uh, at the first try. And finally, same thing, we're gonna place the last part so i'm gonna need my uh, my other hand to do it but uh, yes make sure it's straight as well so you you don't do your job twice there you go so there it is uh this is how it looks this is pretty pretty small compared to what you have in in general it's really slick so uh i'm super happy like uh that that's what i was looking for for a very long time because i saw a lot of different uh, you know uh bikes with the system on and it was very bulky very big but this one is really really nice uh like this is perfect so if you guys are interested i'm gonna i'm gonna put the the website of uh of uh, thornton 100 under and uh there's just one thing to do is to purchase it and then get the kit and you're good to go bye guys <laughs> 